Welcome to Nintendo Ninja News. I'm your host, Chris Dysis, and we are here to um, do a bit of a review roundup. It's not an actual review of the game, but to give you some of the major uh, websites and uh, game public, you know, publishing um, magazines and websites on certain games. And this is for Mario and Rabbits uh, Kingdom Battle, which is pretty cool. So let's have a look at just some of the quotes. Um, Dual Sock Shockers um, gave it 80 out of 100. While the allure of these two franchises coming together may be the draw for many, the surprising depth to its combat and replayability that offers are the real highlights. Interesting. Time magazine gives it a 10 out of 10. It's a fan service fracture that works both as a gonzo strategy masterpiece and series love letter. It's a studio publisher. Uh, Ubisoft, that's been around nearly as long as Nintendo's making video games, reflecting all the whimsy and allure of a franchise that sold half a billion copies worldwide. If you ever wondered what a Nintendo game made by a not by a Nintendo game would look like, here you go. So it gives you uh, that. Uh, Eurogo Gamer gives it recommended. This wonky crossover is the unlikely source of a superbly designed tactical combat challenge as well as a charmingly silly adventure, which is great. Nintendo World Report gives it 9 out of 10. The developers at Ubisoft, um, Mahian and Paris took their time to figure out what works about strategy games and levitate it to a, or elevate it to a form that can be enjoyed by many, add to that the pure cleverness of the adventure and what results in an absolute must-play for Nintendo Switch owners. Uh, and we'll just do one more. Game Informer, while Battle King, well, Kingdom Battles puzzles won't win any awards, the robust selection of challenging tactical battles entertain from beginning to end. So it's looking, it's sort of getting an, you know, 8 to 8.5 on average. That's pretty good score for the game. I think it's a lot higher than what people thought. They were thinking probably 5s and 6s by the look of it. But uh, good to see that this game is um, going to be a good little hit. So we'll see how much it sells. And who knows, it could be the start of something beautiful. So that's it for me. And I shall see you later on.